Happy Up The Words Wednesday, Fish Keepers. What's on the agenda, the agenda today? First time, first thing, far out. I haven't had any coffee yet, can you tell? Ah, just like Popeye, I'm clear-minded. Right. On the agenda today, first thing we're doing is recording the Three Idiots Talk Aquariums podcast. It's live on both YouTube and Facebook. We're doing that in around about 10 minutes time and I'm so far behind it's not funny. After that, we're going to get some stuff done out the back. Hopefully the rest of our plant order arrives and we'll pack up the orders of plants, get that done, get that moving, that'll be done and dusted. We're going to get these going. Snail tanks are going to find their way over into here. Get that job done. I may or may not lift this but probably not because I feel like this might be a two player game so we'll get them done and I'll see if I can get some help lifting these other big tanks moving, get going uh, we'll deal with that top tank with the corridors and stuff like that in it as well so I can start planning that into the shop need to count the fish that we've got sitting in quarantine because they are all being released today so count them, move them get them going, get them into the shop get them available online and in the store that will take up a big, big chunk of my day. Uh, probably the best part of the day, to be totally fair. If I get a chance and some time, we'll drain these four tanks after the flood the other week and refill them, restart them, and we'll get moving with this. Yeah, get rid of this. Uh, I'll try and work out where it leaked. Probably won't fix it. Probably get rid of it. It's got too many bad memories now. So that is pretty much the agenda. I'd like to do some water change in the shop, but I can't see it happening because of uh, having to move these fish. So, let's get on with the podcast first. Three Dance Talk Aquariums podcast, we're three minutes late, let's do it. Ryan, wave, or we four or five, seven minutes late. Come on, Ryan, don't keep the people waiting. I'm going to make sure everybody knows that we are late because Ryan wouldn't wave for the TikTok video. Ryan, Ryan, just do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. My arm's getting tired. Do it! Next day I'll die that's what I do. <laughs> okay. 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 Uh, well, this looks much more like my order of plants. There's all my oxygen weed, duckweed, pond lilies and all that kind of stuff. So that is a positive. We've now got two of the three plant orders today. Now hopefully the next one arrives sometime in the next half an hour or hour or so and we can get on to finishing all the plant orders for the week. Fingers crossed. About a year ago, I might have put a post on Facebook and thought, hey, I want to put up a corkboard type notice board in the shop. Uh, I thought it'd be really cool to, you know, advertise local fish clubs and what local breeders are breeding and that kind of stuff. Uh, as they say, good things take time. I said I'd get it done. Might have been about a year ago, but I've got it done. Uh, for now, it's just got my business cards on it. Uh, but any of the local breeders that I'm aware of that come through in the next few days will say, hey, if you want to put a wee list, of stuff that you're breeding, name, phone number, email sort of thing, chuck it up there. I'll talk to the local aquarium club, see if they want to put some advertising up there as well. Uh, yeah, a little bit counterintuitive, I assume, to what I'm trying to do, which is obviously sell fish to people, but also I think it's fantastic for the idea of community building and stuff like that. So if you're local and you want to put some fish that you're breeding up here, trying to get rid of, go for gold. Um, and yeah, even if you're not local, maybe the FNZAS, might want to put something on there for it uh, upcoming uh, aquarium show up north all that kind of stuff so yeah let me know we'll chuck some things on the board orders of plants are packed the other order still hasn't arrived so i've done everything like possibly humanly can and then some uh, so they are done it's been another 15 or so out the door this afternoon we've still got an order of fish to send away and pack as well my hands are incredibly cold, my fingertips are chilly willy, it is not very warm here today, it's my first massive frost that we got and I'm feeling it in my fingers after dealing with the moist plants and my toes are incredibly cold after standing on concrete, but that's okay. Back in the office where it's a little warm, going to do a bit of graphic design stuff, to get today's overrated, underrated, sorted, we're looking at uh, 2 o'clock now, hopefully about half an hour with the social media stuff and then we'll crack on to moving these damn snails. Fish packed up. Good times. It's all done. Mr. Courier will not be far away. Progress on the snails time. Blue mysteries are in position. Tank beside it's filled up and got a filter bubbling away. So 
next I need to do is come through here, catch the gold lasers, which I'm going to put up into there for the time being, from memory. I think that's what I said I was going to do. So I'll try and get that done this afternoon before the shop closes. Uh, and then I need to work through all these uh, airlines that don't have things on them because there's tanks now that aren't bubbling. And I need tanks to be bubbling, preferably before I go home tonight. Uh, because fish need air. Bit of logic there. Uh, let's catch some gold lasers and get moving.